Hey guys, so today I have a small book haul and uh, what I'm currently reading. So I'm currently reading a couple of books. The first one is Dune by Frank Herbert and I am 127 pages in, so not too far. But so far it's pretty good. The writing's not that great, but the story's good, so I'm liking that. Um, I took out the little book of Huga, is that how you say it? The Danish Way to Live Well. Um, from the library and you know I'm about halfway through and I think I'm gonna DNF it because it's not really saying anything new uh, basically it says that you should light candles be calm be in situations where it's not overly stimulating just be nice and cozy basically so I mean hello I do that all the time anyways so not really learning anything from that I got reawakened by Colleen Hoke. She wrote the Tiger's Curse series. It's a YA series. This is another YA series. And I really liked her other series back in the day, like, I don't know, five years ago. So I'm curious to see if I'm still a fan of her writing or not. I really like the cover. It's really cool looking. Uh, but this is about, like, ancient Egypt. Another book I'm currently reading, I'm actually really enjoying. I am only about 23 pages in, but In the Shadow of the Banyan by Vade Ratner. And I got this from Book Outlet and it's actually autographed. It didn't say anywhere that it was going to be, so it was a total surprise. Um, but yeah, there it is. So this is really interesting so far. It's about Cambodia and I don't really know much about it, um, but so far the characters are likable and it's just good so far. And then lastly, I just put up a review for this one, Fierce Kin Kingdom by Jin Phillips. It was a fast-paced thriller for me. It was pretty good. I had some problems with it. You can check out my full review for my full opinion. Um, but yeah, those are the books I've been reading lately or that I've acquired. And I'm glad to say that most of them have been good so far. So we'll see where that goes. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.